I see you, uh, Mr. H, that your hot pot channel's doing all right. Again, lots of views and. Yeah, it um, seems to be doing okay. Where do you pick your locations from? Um, well, some of How'd them you... I already know about from from memory. You know. How did you come across it all, though? The, 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 you know, like you, see, you turn up from random places. Well, some of them we were. <coughs> excuse me, we were fans. Yeah. You know. Um, and others, you know, we just have a look what's in locality, so that looks like quite interesting. What's your favourite video you've made so far? Uh, have you got one? Well, the best one is that, uh, the best one or the favourite one? Just, one you like? One I like. I would say when we went up on Brinskill Moors and we looked round all those old ruins. Yeah, yeah. It was up there for those like about three houses. hours. Those stone houses. Yeah. Yeah. All old firm ruins yeah, and that, yeah. you know. Um, Basically, we were waterboarding compulsory, purchased it and turned it all into reservoir areas right, right. or catchment areas. And they just left the, the houses to, to fall to pieces? Well, they obviously they stripped off uh, the valuable stuff and then they just fell into disrepair over years. Mm. Quite interesting, really. Yeah. Have you had any backlash from your TV licensing? Um... Um, I did. I used to get a couple of... The, if anybody does anything about against TV licensing, you'll find there's professional trolls that come on. Yeah. Now, whether or not they're actually employed by BBC or not is another matter. Or whether well, someone's paying them. Or whether they're just fucking knobheads. But you have to ask yourself, Jimmy, when these comments come up, who the hell in the right man's defending BBC at two o'clock in the morning? Yeah, yeah. So it's somebody who's paid, I think. Yeah. And I've had one or two who's come on. You can always tell them because they're a naff profile. There's no information on it. Yeah. And uh, they'll just come on and they don't ever attack what you say. You know, they won't say... What are you talking about, mate? The licence fee is good value for money, and this is why. Yeah. They'll just say something like, you fat, smelly bastard. Yeah. You know, and you can't take somebody serious who says something like that, can no. you? No. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, I have had a bit of backlash from it, but most of that's been positive. Yeah, you seem to have been well received in your solo odyssey. Yeah. You know. I mean, I know people probably prefer these sort of things more than that. It, <coughs> you know, it's just, it's just hard, something it's extra, Jimmy. That's horses hard. for courses, mm -hmm. of courses. I mean, you've been at this what now ten years, so I know you don't knock them out as much now. No, do um, I, I don't really watch YouTube much anymore. Um, and my own stuff, but I don't really bother with the Wigan Joker channel. I, I found Facebook's just kinder to me these days. You know, yeah. Facebook, you know, I get more hits and views on Facebook than YouTube, but I'm not. And where I used to be known as him off YouTube, I'm now known as it's him off Facebook. Yeah, so yeah. See, I, I don't like I don't like Facebook. Mm. Uh, pers personally speaking, yeah, it, it, I'm not know. knocking you for what you do. I just I just won't I don't want to invest that sort of time into promoting yeah. yourself because you've got to, haven't you? Yeah, yeah. Like you because otherwise, nobody can get discovered these days. You just get lost beneath the mire. Yeah. And here come the scrubbers on the crosses. Yeah. And on that note, sir, we shall leave it. Of course.